Hey, what's going on, guys? Body B down here. Happy Fourth of July. I'm just thinking about some things and thinking about my body and, you know, why some of us do, you know, work out and why we watch our food intake and all this kind of stuff. And, well, I got to come to the terms that I'm probably never going to have the physique that I want. Uh, so why do I keep doing it? Well, I notice that I feel better. I notice I don't feel like I'm dying all the time. And uh, just overall, I know that my health is better. I just got my blood work done and everything's fine. Only thing that has any concern is still my uh, like gout type issue. You can see some uh, fluctuating there. But you do it to stay healthy, guys, and to be happy. And uh, to be able to live your life. And, uh, you know, not feel weighted down by the extra weight and the sickness that it brings and, and everything. And, you know, we're not all going to get that physique that we're chasing. I have a hard time losing weight, losing fat. And, uh, the fat around my belly is going to be there until long after I'm dead and gone. It's never going to go away. So, and, and to get it to go away, uh, I'm not willing to drop any more calories or change much of anything else up. I already am on a pretty strict eating regimen, diet, you know, small list of foods. And uh, I'm not willing really to change anything else up. I have to get so many calories. I have to get so much protein and so much in me to try not only to just live my daily life and to have some energy to do the things I do, but in order to grow and to get stronger, you have to have those things. So, you know, sometimes you got to sacrifice something to get something else. And, you know, I've, I just, I've kind of come to terms over the last couple of days after just kind of thinking of things and looking at myself and, and all that, that, you know, I'm never going to have that flat stomach that I want. I just don't see it happening. If anyone knows anything magical for people that are very difficult to lose weight, uh, to lose fat, uh, please leave it in the comments because I don't have a clue. My main diet is chicken, turkey, fish, canned tuna fish, and eggs. That's my main meats that I eat. On Saturdays, I have to, that's my cheat day, but I also eat healthy on that day with a few little treats here and there. I don't drink sodas. I drink water 99.99% of the time. Uh, my one treat that I give myself is French vanilla coffee two times a day, once in the morning, once at night. And uh, a lot of times for supper, I'll drink a, a carbonated flavored water. And that's really it. So, as you know, without digging into further stuff like, well, I, I use baby spinach and a little hot sauce and salsa and mustard and vinaigrette dressing and light sodium soy sauce and minced garlic and black pepper and Mrs. Dash and a salt substitute and I use, and I eat asparagus and Brussels sprouts and I mean that's the major, majority of what I eat. I eat a banana every day and I eat a couple of mandarin oranges every day. I eat oats with powdered peanut butter in them. My protein shake, uh, my protein powder in there and uh, a squirt of syrup or honey, whatever I have. I also put a banana in there. So, I mean, you just heard my diet like pretty much six days a week, six and a half days a week, probably. So, 
you know, I can't do any more exercising. There's nothing else I can do, nothing else I'm willing to do as far as exercise goes. I walk every day, I spin on the bike every day, and I lift weights six days a week. I do the cardio seven days a week. So I've always held on to weight, though, always. Uh, and, and, you know, and you can always say, yeah, but your diet wasn't in check then. Yeah, but even if it was, I would have held on to weight. My body, my DNA just, uh, it makes me hold on to weight fairly easily. So, boy, this one minute short video turned into a six minute video. Good grief. Anyway, guys, I just wanted to throw it out there and just let you know that we all struggle with trying to reach our goals. And uh, sometimes they're obtainable and sometimes they're just a little bit out of reach. So if I get a flat stomach, great. And I'm not looking for abs. I'm just looking for a flat stomach just to get rid of that little gut I have that won't go away. If I get it, okay. If I don't, okay. And uh, I'm just going to keep pushing forward and doing the best I can. And uh, that's what you guys have to do. And uh, don't give up. And just because we don't get that perfect body don't mean that we're not actually doing something really good and healthy for ourselves. And that's the whole idea, the whole meaning behind all this, really, at the end of the day, is just to be healthy. So as healthy as we can. So anyway, guys, I just wanted to kind of touch base and get that off my chest a little bit and let you know that we all are out here struggling just a little. So have a good fourth. Uh, enjoy your day. Like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff to the Body Beatdown. And don't forget, guys, get up, get out, get red. Do it to it. We'll see you next time on the Body Beatdown.